All right, I am back once again, and I finally have received the Loot Fright for July. Now, I have officially canceled my Loot Fright, um, as I've been waiting for months and months and months and months for the service. And right now I'm just skeptical and I'd rather just keep it on hold. Um, I still have one more item from them, which is my loot wear for her. And hopefully that will come. So let's start unboxing and seeing what we have inside the July Loot Fright. We can open this book. All right, whoops. Sorry, buddy. So we have our card, which I will set aside. First item. I wonder what these are for. 3D glasses. Interesting. I wonder what else is in this box. Why I would need 3D glasses. Let's find out. And as you can see, Dipper wants his box. Yeah. All right, so let's start. Let's see what else we got here. We have the slaughtered lamb. An American werewolf in Paris. Let's open this box. It says, ooh, Loot Fright pint glass. Let's check it out. You want to see what it looks like? Too, don't you don't see Yeah, you do. I do too. So once again, it looks like here we got a pint glass. If you remember the last box I did, which was the May one that I got recently, there was a <laughs> glass in there as well. But this one looks kind of cool. Here it is. It's from an, um, from an American werewolf in Paris. Well, that's neat. Okay. Come on, buddy. You can't make yourself too comfortable right now. We have a video to do. Alright, next up, we have a shirt. Do you dare enter the house on Haunted Hill? So there's what that looks like. That looks kind of cool. And it's soft material feeling-ish. So definitely I will wear that. Next we have, ooh, something from Annabelle. Annabelle comes home. Warning, positively do not open. Oh, this is what we need the, the uh, 3D glasses for. I don't know where I just put those. Oh well. Um, hmm, oh well, we'll find them later. So let's open this up, because it looks like here you put your the glasses on, you cover the left eye, cover your right eye and I guess you see certain things. So I'm opening up Annabelle. Check her out. Now oh, I'm kind of wondering what I did with those. Oh, they're on the floor. Get on the glasses. Ooh, there they are. How does this go? Just like, oh, there we go. We have Annabelle. And it, you see Annabelle here. There looks like there's a little demon right in here. So let's check this out. Oh, huh, here we go. Here's the front angle. Sorry, everybody. So let's see. We can see. Ooh, there's just Annabelle. I'm going to cover my left. Ooh, and I see the demon. Okay, so it works. I mean, it's okay. But I don't think I would keep this around. I just don't know where I would put it. So finally, our last item is in this bag. Or actually, hold on, there's one more after this. But anyways, it's in this bag. So this envelope. And it is... Prices aren't the only thing getting slashed. 
Slaycation 3, Horus Trap. So it looks like here, ugh, a movie poster-ish looking thing, because there's like that stuff there. I do like the overall design. This will probably go in one of my kids' room, because they kind of like this type of stuff. And I'm sure it will end up in my youngest, in his room, on his wall. Because he'll just like the design of it, because I think it is kind of cool. And finally we have our Loot Fright pin that you receive in every Loot Crate. So that's it for our Loot Fright Crate. I mean, it was better than the one that was for me. I will say that. Um, not terribly disappointed. I don't really care for the other little thing, but hey. But otherwise, everything else wasn't terrible. So, but that's it for this episode of the Loot Fright unboxing. And again, I probably will not be ordering one for quite some time until I know everything is afloat. So that's it for this segment. I hope you leave me a comment. I love reading them and I'll see you later.